Welcome to Automotive Territory! It has been a while since we last covered the newcomers to the electric car market. Unfortunately, the news about EV releases were rather dull and uneventful these past few weeks. But alas, we are ready to reveal to you our digest of the latest presentations and debuts of all new electric cars and concepts. These four-wheelers are getting more and more powerful, ranges go well over 200 miles and at times over 400. Autonomous driving is getting more sophisticated and speed exceeds our imagination. Are you already anxious to see these emission-free marvels of car making? Before we cut to the chase, subscribe to our channel for more videos about the wonderful world of electric vehicles. Enjoy the ride! BMW iX3 The electric soft-roader Audi e-tron is about to hit the conveyor and the Mercedes EQC is already going through the final testing. And now the movement has been joined by BMW, which has just presented a new all-electric crossover iX3. Unlike the competition, Bavarian Motor Works have decided to build their car on the base of the already existing series production model X3 on the Clare platform. Preliminary specifications indicate that this BMW will get a 270 horsepower motor linked to a 70 kWh battery, good for 250 miles and compatible with a 150 kW charger. The series production SAV iX3 will be manufactured in China starting from 2020 and will become the first car from this manufacturer to receive the fifth generation powertrain eDrive. It will be followed by the sedan iNext and other vehicles which already have reserved indexes from i1 to iX9. The Vision Mercedes Maybach Ultimate Luxury This luxury electric crossover is the direct heir to the Vision Mercedes Maybach 6 Cabriolet. It is geared up with four compact electric motors with combined output of 750 horsepower or 550 kilowatt with independent all-wheel drive. The max speed is electronically limited to 155 miles per hour. The capacity of the installed battery is 80 kilowatt hour. It has 350 kilowatt architecture and is good enough for 200 miles according to EPA standards. As any other Maybach, the CV was constructed for the ultimate pleasure of its occupants. All of the seats have massage functions. The interior is finished with leather, natural wood, polished metal, and such functions as lighting and air conditioning have individual settings. And finally, do you want to hear about the most peculiar feature of this car? Well, the designers felt compelled to add a niche with a teapot and cups, as well as a vase to the interior. SF Motors, SF5 and SF7 This company was founded in Silicon Valley in 2016, and unlike other notorious electric car paper manufacturers, it is aggressively entering the market. The Chinese-backed startup has recently acquired the battery manufacturer Inevit, with Martin Aberhardt, the co-founder and former Tesla CEO at the helm, got hands on the factory in Indiana that used to produce Hummers, and another one in China. Their first two models are SF5 and SF7, built on the self-designed modular platform that allows constructing nearly any modification of EVs with one to four motors. The top modification should be able to produce 1000 horsepower and accelerate to 60 miles per hour under 3 seconds. The patented battery technology ensures 300 miles of range and a special highly efficient generator has been developed for customers with special range needs. The first model to hit production in 2019 will be the SF5 crossover, which will be equipped with the third-level autopilot hardware labeled Protective Autonomy. Pininfarina HKGT Concept Taking to the habit of revealing beautiful car concepts at major auto shows, this year Pininfarina decided to treat us with something really special. The famous Italian car design firm built an all-electric coupe called Hybrid Kinetic Gran Turismo Concept that puts a modern twist on the classic Italian styling. The car has a 2 plus 2 seating arrangement, aggressive sculpted rear and futuristic gullwing doors. HKGT also boasts of 0 to 60 acceleration time of 2.7 seconds and the top speed of 217 miles per hour. Developed due to its four electric motors with a combined output of 1073 horsepower. Unfortunately, the new Pininfarina's battery does not match the expectations 
as it is only good for 100 miles of electric range. To resolve this issue, the company, in cooperation with Hong Kong-based Hybrid Kinetic Group, developed three range extended solutions, a microturbine generator, a hydrogen fuel cell system, or an old-school internal combustion engine. LVG Auto Venere Even though the Chinese startup LVG that is based in Shanghai was founded just in 2016, it has already released two electric car concepts. The first one was Urano Coupe, and the latest one is a four-door sedan Venere. The newcomer was developed in cooperation with the Italian designer Institute IDEA and is promised to be placed on the conveyor by the end of 2019 in either Turin, Italy or Jilin City, China. LVG Venere is a premium class 4-seater equipped with a 1000 horsepower powertrain, which consists of 100 kWh battery and 4 motors that produce 1135 pound-feet of torque. The claimed range is limited by 405 miles, 0-6 to six acceleration is clocked at 2.5 seconds, and the speed is maxed out at 177 miles per hour. The futuristic hardware of the CV includes rear-view cameras instead of mirrors, Brembo brakes, Pirelli P0 tires, and multiple touchscreens on the dashboard. Audi e-tron Vision Gran Turismo Previously developed only for the racing simulator on PlayStation 4, the e-tron Vision GT has now been fulfilled in real life. According to Audi, the concept is equipped with three electric motors, two on the rear axle and one up front, giving this futuristic beast an all-wheel drive capability. The joint output equals to 815 horsepower, while the weight of the car is just over 3,000 pounds. As a result, all the combined power and light weight allow the Vision GT to hit the first 16 mph within 2.4 seconds. The concept won't be participating in competitions anytime soon. It is rather tasked with popularizing Formula E races, as well as the upcoming all electric e tron lineup from Audi. Notably, the Audi e-tron Vision GT is painted white, red and black to remind us about the legendary automobiles Audi 90 IMSA GTO, which were famous in 1980s. By the way, not so long ago we covered electric car releases at the 2018 CES, Geneva and New York Auto Shows. Check out those videos too, you won't regret it. Links in the description and the info card above. Let's keep rolling. Lincoln Co. 01 Chances are that you have not heard much about the Chinese car brand Lincoln Co. Moreover, haven't seen any of their cars yet. But just an FYI, they are expected to become a rising star of the automaking. The brand is owned by the rapidly growing Chinese giant Geely and is considered among the most innovative automakers from Asia. The 01 is built on the platform of another Geely subsidiary, Volvo XC40. And if today in China it is sold with a 1.5 liter and turbo 2.0 liter four cylinders, when it arrives to the US and Europe in 2020, it shall only come in plug in hybrid or purely electric forms. This crossover is youth oriented and claimed to be the most smart connected auto of today. The smallest display that is offered is a high definition 10.2 inch touchscreen running on a unique software, and it is packed with features. Isdera Commendatore GT Though you have probably never heard of Isdera, it is a legendary German private automaker that specializes in custom-building luxury automobiles since 1969. Last year, the company began a new page in its history when it was purchased by Hong Kong investment fund Sinfonia. Now, after a 12-year-long break since its last release model, it introduced an all-new purely electric sports car with impressive total power output of 805 horsepower. Its Derecommendator GT has unique coupe styling, gullwing doors, and is the first company sports car with a 2 plus 2 seating. Unlike its predecessor built in 1990s, the automobile has only original parts developed by its Dera engineers. Weighing 3858 pounds, it sprints to 60 in 3.7 seconds and is capable of delivering 187 miles per hour top speed, though it has an electronic speed limiter at 155 mph. So far only one Commendator GT was built, but the company plans to finish another one by the end of 2018. 
the WIDR supercar. Built to conquer the 2018 Pikes Peak International Hill Climb, this new VW Electro car packs some serious power and punch capabilities. It is equipped with a pair of electric motors, delivering the total power output of 680 horsepower and 469 pound-feet of torque. In addition, the auto weighs only 2,500 pounds and is capable of going from 0 to 60 in just 2.25 seconds. With such acceleration, the new VW is slightly faster than the Model S launching in ludicrous mode. Being one of the quickest automobiles ever built by VW, IDR Supercar can even challenge Formula E and Formula 1 racers. The company plans that with their IDR Supercar, Romain Dumas, the defending Pike Peak champion, will be able to beat the all-time record for an electric car of 8 minutes 57 seconds that was previously set in 2016. Nissan Selfie Zero Emission Unveiled at Auto China 2018 in Beijing, new Selfie is a zero-emission sedan based on the next-generation Nissan LEAF platform. Unlike his famous hatchback brother, the car will not target the US and Europe and will be released exclusively for the flourishing Chinese market. Selfie's bumper, V-Motion grille, headlamps, blue accents and wheels are all derived from LEAF's styling. Its interior will likely have similar architecture and identical infotainment system. The car will be equipped with an electric drivetrain and lithium-ion batteries will be installed under the seats. However, their power and capacity have not been announced yet. The model's declared extended range is 210 miles, 15 miles less than that of e version of LEAF. The Nissan Selfie Zero Mission is planned to become the first mass-production EV among the 20 that will be introduced for China by 2022. You're correct if you think that there were too many concepts in this episode, but in our opinion they look more and more mature and closer to the real-life models ready to support the EV revolution that is taking place in our world. Thanks for being with us today. Watch other episodes suggested on this screen, subscribe, thumbs up and share. And as always, may the torque be with you!